Hi, welcome to another video from Dr. Lock. We're going to show you a display board now for locks. This is uh, one that we've got on our lock shop. As you can see, it just comes in this plain box here. It's quite big. I've had to zoom out so you can see it. When I open it up, we've got the base plate and then we've got the top plate. These are great for hardware shops or locksmith shops or anywhere that sells locks or somewhere you'd like to display a lock. You can even um, use them, let's say, as a uh, uh, one of those little fancy places that sell houses or so and you want to show different products that you actually install on the doors This is perfect. This one here comes set up for a digital lock But it wouldn't take much to actually change it to a standard type of door lock. This particular one here. We're going to change to um, a 54 mil hole here and we're going to change it to a 32 mil hole here. We're not going to do it on this video here But I'm just going to um, let you know what we're going to do with this one so this one here, you can see the latch, latch cut out right here. This allows for a latch to go in there quite nice and neatly. It's all got a very nice finish here. It's a wood finish. Uh, looks like some sort of spray painting has been done on it. Uh, very nice, very nice counter display. Uh, they're not expensive, but when you've got something on your counter, you'd like it to actually look nice. So I'm just un unwrapping it here. See the bottom's a different color. Uh, pre-drilled holes, pre-countersunk holes, allowing you to attach the top part and the bottom part for a counter display. We're going to be using this one to show you the differences of locks and things like that on some of our next videos. So it's a bit of an investment for us to buy one of these. For anybody else who sells locks, hardware shops or anything, this is perfect for you. You basically just put that on there like that. It's very hard to see with my camera work there. And then you would have your lock on there and every time somebody comes and asks the same question about the same lock you can say look this is the lock this is how it operates so this is a display board for counters basically fits up just like that now this particular one also includes the screws but unfortunately the screws have kind of uh, fallen in in here somewhere they're in there i just have to fish them out Sorry, I probably should have done a little bit of preparation before this video to remove the screws. Wait a second, I have some uh, handy tweezers here. I'll just get them out there quickly. Okay, tweezers do the job again. So you've just got some basic uh, wood screws. We're probably talking about 50, 55 to 60 mil long. And they go together to complete this board. And that's what we're going to do now. We're going to simply assemble it. On the bottom of here you can also see the two pre-drilled holes. This is great because when you're putting it together, if you were to screw it together crooked or anything like that, um, if they weren't pre-drilled you wouldn't know exactly where the center is to keep it symmetrical. Like if you would look at it there, you've got half on one side, half on the other side, and it, exactly where it needs to be. By having these pre-drilled holes means that our display board is going to look perfect when we put it together. I'm going to push that in there push that in there okay using a friendly DeWalt I like the extended drill bit it comes in very very handy but just a screwdriver with a Phillips 2 bit on it nothing special there get from your hardware so I'm putting this together here as you can see just putting uh, the tips of the screws into the holes I'm using my Phillips head driver now And there we go, they're both, uh, both catching on. And that is our display board, right there. Now if you like, you simply need to just re-drill this. Uh, we have a re-drilling tool as well, I'll show you how to re-drill that. Up here should be a deadlock, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to re-drill this to a 32 mil hole. I'm going to re-drill this to a 54 mil hole. This will allow us to mount any standard lock we want. We've got our latch cut out here, which is perfectly done, very nicely done, which is perfect for uh, examples of locks that we show. This is available on our lock shop at drlock.com.au, and if you've got any further queries about it, please call. Thank you.